Just finished up an afternoon workout and uh, made a little snack for myself. Big old hunkin' salad. Normally I haven't been into the salads too much. I know that I probably don't eat as many as I should, but I think it's because I really don't like lettuce that much. But I've been making these spinach salads, and I just wanted to show you guys like a pretty simple recipe that I've been doing. It's only a few ingredients, and I got uh, so here's my salad. I got the red peppers, cucumbers, and then the bottom is just all baby spinach. So three ingredients in the salad. I think it's uh, two two small cucumbers, a whole bunch of greens, and then a red pepper and a half. And then this is going to be the dressing right here. So I've got uh, avocado, orange, uh, red pepper, and then underneath that, cherry tomatoes. So we'll just blend that all up. Hey, what up everybody? It's Ironclad. Welcome to day three of 28 Days of Meditation. Um, real excited. Been getting a lot of comments. People saying, I'll join you. I'll do this too. Totally didn't expect that. I'm glad people are getting inspired. That's awesome. That keeps me more inspired and motivated. Honestly, I just did this to post videos every day to keep my own self accountable because I've been wanting to get in the habit really bad and I've been you know, so inconsistent. And so really, this was a really self-centered thing for me to just want to uh, build accountability with myself. But other people are getting inspired and doing it too. I think that's awesome. I think if you want to join in, even though it's day three, go ahead, do it. Um, get started. I uh, totally got your back. I'd love to see it. I think some Fruit Zen already made a video response, which I got to go watch. Awesome. Uh, I'm really stoked on it. Uh, one thing I will say, though, is um, I really believe in one habit at a time. I think that to uh, have the best chance of success, you focus, like, just zone in tunnel vision on one habit. Uh, I know other people are doing things like 100 squats a day, 100 push-ups a day. Someone said, let's hug some ev someone every day. Uh, I think those are all great things uh, if you want to do those too. I'm not doing the 100 squats a day right now. I am focused laser on one thing. And this is based on my own experiences, trying to change my own habits over the years. I've made a lot of positive changes. I used to be a lot, uh, you know, I've made a lot of positive changes with myself. Big into self-improvement and I found that doing one thing at a time really helps. So i got nothing against 100 squats a day. I've seen you know, a bunch of you guys are doing that with Ted Carr. I think it's awesome. Rock out, go do it, 100 squats a day. I love squats. Maybe at some point I'll join in. But right now for me, like the most important thing is like taking care of up here and up here. My ass looks fine. Yeah. So don't need to do the 100 squats a day. Personally, I think you should do one thing. So if you really are looking to get in shape, and that's more important than uh, cleaning the uh, dust and grime out of your brain, then by all means do 100 squats a day. Um, if you think you would better serve you to to um, help your, your brain and your emotions and all that, do the meditation every day. I mean, just, I would say pick one thing, but if you wanna do two or three or five, awesome, go do it. So uh, thanks for watching every guy, you guys, and I uh, just wanna let you know, meditation's been going great. Um, did it outside today, and uh, took my dogs for a little walk out of the woods, and then just sort of tied them to a post for a little while, and uh, meditated out in the woods, and. There was a bunch of birds chirping, and uh, it was really nice. No big breakthroughs, but um, I've been feeling really, really good. So that's all for now. Take care, guys.